Walton B in lane two, Trent in lane four, oh, lane one, um, Kingston Grammar School lane four, and Bedford Modern School in lane three. Meanwhile, in race 31, uh, the race is now approaching the 1750 metre mark, and from our position here in the tower, it looks very much as if it's uh, lane lane four who are in the lead, um, and that is Cardiff City. They seem to have quite a considerable lead by lane two, uh, City of Cambridge, and behind them, lane three, lane six rather, who are Sir William Perkins School. And the Race 32 um, is passing the 1750 metre mark. Uh, this is um, the final of the women's junior under, under 18 double skulls. And from our position here, it's a pretty close race actually between lanes 2, 3, and 6. Well, from our position here, we can see that there's not a lot to choose between these, these, these boats. So we seem to we can see four uh, quadruple skulls in this event, although uh, six are listed, namely lanes uh, two, four, five, and six. So William Borlays, Multi Boat Club, Tybee Scudders, and Star and Arrow. At 1500 metres, it's still very close, particularly between lane six, Star and Arrow, and lane four, Multi Boat Club. And behind them are Sir William Borlase in lane two and Tyrese Colour School in lane five. A lane a race 33 is now past the 1750 metre mark. Well, we're, we're waiting for the detailed information for a thousand metres on. Um, race 34 and interesting there are two clubs in this event with two crews in the final, final Malsey Boat Club and Boyhood Rowing Club so um, it, there's inter-club and inter Nissan strife going on here on the water from our position here in the tower it looks very much as if lane 4 are leading Oh, I've just been corrected, it's lane five. Come on, girls, come on, you're getting out, come on! Right, I can confirm that it's five who are leading at the moment. The confusion is the fact that uh, lane one is actually somewhere behind the umpire's door. The launch was temporarily invisible from up here. Anyway, lane five are currently leading this race. That's Mortley, Anglian and Alpha. Five at a thousand meters. The leading crew was Bolsey in lane four. And they were about a half a length in front of Upper Thames Rowing Club in lane five. They in turn were in front of Taurus in lane two. Uh, were in front of Derby in lane one. Derby was some distance in front of Marlow in lane six. Go, go, go. 
At 1,500 metres in race 35, um, the situation had not greatly changed. It was uh, lane four again, Molsey in the lead, followed by Upper Thames in lane five. Some tough information there then. We said again, at 1,000 metres, it was Lady in an office, followed by Headington School, who were closely ahead of uh, Kingston Grammar School in lane four, then Tybase Colour School and King School Chester in lane three. Okay, race 36 is now past the 1500 meter, and here um, there's a slight change in the order. At 1500, was Lady on the Hollis. Hollis in lane 5, then Kingston Grammar School in lane 4, and lane 2, and um, Tarbis Colour School in lane 6. And those three groups, um, Kingston Grammar School, Headington School, and Tarbis Colours, very close together, and in fifth place was Kingston Chester. Boat Club Lane 4, Mosey Boat Club Lane 7. 